Dear colleagues, you can see a corneal opacity in this case. It is actually adherent leukoma. I did this case. Cataract surgery was done in this case few days back. At that time, the pupil was nicely dilated. And I could not make out that this patient will have some visual hindrance because of this corneal opacity. Now, since this is adherent leukoma, the pupil is drawn inferiorly towards 6 o'clock where there is corneal opacity. So, the patient is having tremendous loss of vision. So, my plan in this case is to do optical aridectomy. I mean, to excise a portion of the iris which is in the superior part. And now here it is the irrigation goes through the right side port. The side ports have been opened and the cutter goes through the left side port and I have started cutting the iris. And now I am going to trim it little more. That's it. The aridectomy is done. And now, in this case, I want to do Kenacort lavage and release, try to release the aridocorneal adhesion. If I try to release the aridocorneal adhesion, there can be some reaction, there can be some iditis. To reduce that, I want to do this triamcinolone acetate lavage. And before that, I want to hydrate the side ports and close these wounds. What I mean by Kenacort lavage is I will inject a bit of Kenacort and then I will wash it out. Few particles of Kenacort will remain even after this wash and that will prevent lot of inflammatory signs. Lot of inflammation will be reduced by those Kenacort particles. Kenacort means transneuron acetate. It has been injected. Now I am taking a uh, Simco cannula 23 gauze and aspirating this Kenacort. Most of it is removed. Few particles are remaining on the iris here and there. And these particles will reduce this. Here I am releasing the aridocorneal addition by the Simco cannula itself. It has been nicely released. And that's it. The case is done. So, in this case, I have shown some tricks to do optical aridectomy. Thank you very much for your attention.